I'm gonna get a coffee actually, I'll be right back. back on the solo comms. So, Inzi, not only I think he has a bit of trouble with this matchup, um, he is also having a bit of trouble with his leg right now, uh, which has been uh, injured in a nondescript accident. But yeah, I think the hard part is that if he gets you off stage, you just do arrows, and like, Ike uh, dies. He, he doesn't really uh, doesn't really do very well against them. Um, so he like almost killed him there. Like that would have been dead if that uh, forward air hit. Nice. Not dead though. And yeah, it just feels like uh, Inzi kind of gets lapped. Side B in Nuke. Taken out. Oh, also this is annoying as hell, but you don't need to tell me that. Or I don't need to tell you that. Uh, you've probably all heard enough of me complaining about fit. Ooh, doesn't go for the down air there. Goes for the back air instead, and Inzi seals it out. With like everything is doable, but this, like, I don't see him making this back. I see him getting down air. Not quite. Oh my god, he stole it. Yep. <laughs> Rest in peace. That was uh, probably supposed to be a. I should just. It's probably supposed to be a. Uh, this is not winners' quarters. I mean, this is not winners' quarters. Um, he was supposed to do side B there. So yeah, this is a best of five, I think. Top 12, usually best of five at Pixel Bar and Cafe. Alright, whiffs in right from the start. We love a good opening whiff. Uh, my favourite kind, personally. And sneaking past that back air with the jump. Inzi hasn't been... Oh, that was really cute. The parry into Trump, that's crazy. Um, but yeah, Inzi hasn't been like getting as owned off stage as he usually does, I feel. But uh Yeah, it's still looking pretty grim. It's just like Bin has this down to a flow chart. Dead. See ya. Good job on second in Perth. Thanks man. I tried really hard. <laughs> uh yeah, so this rapid jab. Pretty degen at the ledge. Uh, yeah, I know I'm, I'm messing with you. Um, I am in Victoria. I'm definitely not second in Uh All right, gets up bead. Didn't really see how that even happens. I think Inzi is in disadvantage. I got a little bit distracted by the pop off there. Who's on comms? Extra is on comms. Hello. Uh, yep, yeah, and that's the rinse repeat. Arrow, arrow, dare spike. Done for real. Yeah, I think Fried is probably, uh, probably second, right? Yeah. Just doesn't go to anything because he's like a child or whatever. Alrighty. Going for the Aether. Doesn't get punished as hard. Yeah, 
Um, I feel like in this matchup, Ike just doesn't get to play to his strength, which is living forever and getting rage kills because Finn is just so good at killing him early. And that's probably done. Yeah, yeah. Got scared by the arrow. Just pulled early. Kind of had to pull early, honestly. And we the game two, Finn. Oh, thank you. Got my caffeine. I think it's a necessity for this bracket. I was up at seven. I'm a bit tired now. Back to Smashville. I just feel like Inzi has to, I don't know, he just, in order to win this, he just needs to take his neutral to the next level. And he needs to not get trolled as much when Bin is off stage or at the ledge. Um, I feel like those are the big deciders, really. But still, <laughs> goes for the hard read there. And he still has his jump as well. Alright, so he makes it back off the ledge. Very scary situation. Ooh, I feel like if that was a full hop back air, uh, that might have been dead actually. Nice little directional air dodge there from Bin. He's having to try pretty hard to hold onto this stock though. Inzi going with the Nair there, not actually getting an up air kill. I feel like that glyph was a misinput, but I might be wrong. I feel like he tried to forward tilt. Okay. Goes for the dash attack again, doesn't quite work out. But Bin hasn't quite been getting his punishes this game. I feel like Inzi's he's getting a little bit used to uh, the options Bin picks in advantage. Um, and he's just not quite letting him uh, get his, like, stupid stuff. Like there. Like, I feel like game one Inzi would have died to that. Oh, he DI's out on that. Alright. Inzi can't really get his advantage started. That Australian DI. Ooh. That was a Northern Territory air dodge, that's for sure. <laughs> um, yeah, it's not looking good for our hero, Ike. Um, currently got no friends, no mates to help him out to fight for. Um, And yeah, I mean, 43% isn't a huge deficit, but it just sucks to like get lapsed that early. Ooh, he goes to the grab. And yeah, these nares, like it just feels like when um, Inzi's pressing a button, Bin's like doing something defensive. And when Bin's, or when he's not doing something defensive, um, he's like just hitting Inzi. All right. Takes that stock, still doable, definitely doable. Gets crossed up, that's nasty. And yeah, I think um, I think this was pretty in Inzi's favor at the start of the game. Um, and then it just kind of like went, oof, 